As I think about my first meeting with Mother Angelica and how she appeared to me and the virtues that I saw there, she was a contemplative. She was someone who I saw as I gazed at her face that she had been gazing upon the face of God in Eucharistic adoration in other ways. She was contemplative. She had encountered the Lord and she also had a sense of urgency. She was one who believed that Jesus Christ was coming again and that we should live holy lives and that we should declare the gospel of Jesus Christ and prepare others, especially the least, to meet the Lord. She was a contempt urgent, contempt urgent, both contemplative and urgent. And so should we be as missionaries, contemplative, gazing upon the Lord, especially at Eucharistic adoration and as we receive the Lord in the sacraments, and urgent to bring this message of Christ and the church to the world, the whole world. Let's be contemplurgians like our founders, Mother Angelica. In June, EWTN favorite Susan Conroy is back with a new five-part mini-series shot on location in Maine, Coming to Christ, Young Adults and the Church, explores how young people are embracing Christ and his church. And Diana Von Glan hosts a look back at Pope Francis' recent visit to the Holy Land. Relive this historic visit and the message of peace he brought to this troubled region in a papal pilgrimage to the Holy Land. Plus, look for a new documentary on the rebirth of the church in Russia. You'll hear moving testimonies from parishioners who now, for the first time in decades, are able to attend a church that the Soviet authorities closed down. Hear this miraculous story in reviving the Roman Catholic Church in Eastern Russia. Now do the work of a missionary. Upload this information through email, Facebook, and Twitter. Let us contemplate the face of the Lord. Let us believe in his coming again. And let us be urgent to take this message to everyone we can. God bless you and all of your loved ones. Bye now.